Welcome back to the SCRS booth. Aaron Schulenberg here uh, at the very close of day one of the SEMA show here in 2014, joined by Paul Massey with Ford. Um, Paul, you guys have, this is your last big show uh, before your brand new 2015 F-150 is released, right? Yeah, this is, uh, this is the, the third uh, trade show that we've gotten out to, to help ready the repair industry for the, the new F-150. Made of high strength, military grade, aluminum alloy. Uh, it's new in the industry. It's going to be uh, you know, a high volume vehicle and we just want to make sure that the repairers are ready to work on the vehicle. Yeah, so repairability has been a really big focus for you all, right? And, and, and it was interesting. I was having some conversation with some of the folks at the Aluminum Association and they were just talking about the integration that they've had with your team and, and, and the focus you all have had on repairability that's just really unsurpassed. So what's that What's that look like for you all? Well, it, it really started in 2009 before we even made the final decision that we we're going to make the vehicle out of aluminum. The engineers came to the uh, customer service engineering group and uh, engaged us in marketing and them to really look at the market and could we build a solution to help educate the collision industry prior to the vehicle being launched. We didn't want to wait till it was launched like, like would normally happen on a vehicle launch. We wanted to get them ready, communicate, get them comfortable with it because we knew it was a big change. And once we could support that we could deliver that, that's kind of when the final decisions were made that we could go ahead with the aluminum vehicle. So a lot of it hinged on being able to get the industry ready to work on this vehicle. Sure. Well, and that's been the focus of everybody, right? I mean, they, they, I feel like this year has been the talk of the F-150. And, uh, you know, it's got to make a lot of people here at the SEMA show excited because there's a lot of people walking around looking at solutions, looking at products, looking at equipment, looking at things that they can do to ready their business. Um, if you were to give a suggestion on where somebody could go to, to, to kind of say, hey, I want to make sure I'm looking at the right stuff, what, yeah. what would be the place that they could go? Well, there, there's, uh, there's, there's the Ford booth, and Ford's always had a large vehicle presence at the SEMA show. This year, we have a, a collision presence also, and we wanted it to be in the collision section. So, by all means, please visit the Ford booth in the main hallway. But get back to the Ford booth in the Westgate it's um, booth number 16021, and there we've got the uh, cutaway version of the vehicle. You can lay your hands on it. You can look at how it's assembled. We've got some of the uh, repair equipment in the booth, parts, and then also if you want to learn about our National Body Shop Network, uh, we've got the Assured Performance folks there to really help explain all that Ford has done uh, to get ready for this launch. Uh, previously, we also worked with ICAR and worked on the training. So that's all developed and ready to go. So it kind of fits in. Ford, Ford's been a long supporter of our education programs here at the SEMA show. I know that's important to you all. It's, it's part of that getting the industry ready. And then when we launched this year our OEM Collision Repair Technology Summit, you guys were one of those companies that said, absolutely, we want to be a part of this. We want to support you. And not only are you supporting it as a sponsor, but um, you are also involved in some of those panel discussions that we're having right. tomorrow. We're really excited about that because I think putting um, automakers and certifiers and certified shops and equipment suppliers all in one room to spend a day focusing on this discussion is going to be really beneficial to the industry. What do you think is one of the best things that can come out of that? Well, it, there's two things. We've had our, our engineers here and they've actually been at some of your training mm -hmm. and will continue to do more of that training. And so that gives the, the collision repair a first-hand chance to talk to the engineers and get it straight from the engineers about what are the proper repair procedures. Tomorrow's um, uh, discussion will be more on our National Body Shop Network. The industry is, is really sort of embraced this certification process and uh, Ford has the National Body Shop Network which is there to ensure that not only for general repair but for the aluminum repairs that the uh, body shops are ready uh, to, to meet those challenges. And so that's what we'll be discussing is the Ford program, working with Assured Performance, and um, what would a body shop need to do if they wanted to be part of that network. So for someone who's not here, and you're missing out if you're not here, but if for somebody who's not here who wants to learn more about it, where can they go to get more information? Uh, the best way uh, to look it up would be to contact Assured Performance directly. Great. Well, you know, it's a lot of information to deliver. It's, uh, it's it, everybody's excited. It'll be really interesting to see how that all plays in, in that preparation stage for the industry. 
it's going to be a big change for everybody. And it's, and, 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 and it's good that you guys have gone through the due diligence of making sure that information is out there. SEMA is not just about products, it's also about information. And that's exactly why Ford's here, it's why we're here, is to deliver good information that can help shops be better at their businesses. Paul, thanks so much for what you guys do. Thanks for your support in our programs. We'll look forward to seeing everybody tomorrow at the OEM Collision Repair Technology Summit and back here at the SCRS booth.